you have a new addition to the team? You want to talk yeah, about we it? got yeah. Um, we have uh, Rob McDonald. I'm, uh, Jason McDonald. Jason McDonald. I keep calling him Rob. <laughs> uh, if you're listening, Jason, it's Jason. We call him, <laughs> we call him Papa Jay. Uh, and he yeah, he's been coming down and, and training with us, and we'll be training him for this uh, this uh, Franklin fight. Um, so he's been about a month down here, I guess. And that's confirmed now, the, that fight, is it, or that was... Yeah, as far as I know, it better be confirmed. We're training our tails off. <laughs> going on so, YouTube. Uh, yeah. yeah, so uh, the, uh, yeah, I hope that's okay with the UFC, but yeah, um, we're training our tails off for it, so, uh, uh, and then, yeah, after this fight, we'll see what happens next with him, but uh, yeah, he's just been a great addition to the team. All the boys love him, and... Okay. Uh, He's just a he's just a great individual with a lot of good skills, and hopefully uh, he can help us, and we can help him. Yeah, he was actually great the first time that he was on the show. I mean, it was total surprise. Rashad showed up, and he had Jason McDonald with him. So, and yeah. he seemed like a great guy. So uh, he sure he is. seems like a good addition to the team. <clears throat> they call him Papa Jay because he's like he's very dadly. He he's even reminding me, Greg, don't forget to do this. Don't forget. I'm like, oh, thanks, Jay. You know what I mean? That's just how uh, that's just how he is now. If I could stop getting hit in the head for a living and call him. Jason, Rob, so Rob. Uh, we'd be all right. Just I do it all the time. I'm like, yeah, hey, Rob. Uh. Just, just think of a different name like Bill or Bob or something right. like that. Bill just, McDonald. Just call him Jimmy McDonald or something Jimmy like that. McDonald. <laughs> After my son. Yeah. Hey, we want to thank all the YouTube uh, people for watching us and uh, subscribing to our, uh, to our, to our, I guess, a video, video cast or whatever it is. So, thank you all the YouTube people and, of course, thanks to Coach Craig Jackson for coming in. No worries. Um, hey, if you had anybody like, if if you could pick a person out there like another fighter that you'd like to add to the camp. Is there a name you would want to throw out there? You the know? only guy that we're going to add to the camp, I think, of the big name fighters is George St. Pierre. Right. Um, him and Diego have to uh, kind of fight and get there. So he's an ally right now. Right. Um, but for all intents and purposes, he's part of the team. Um, right. He'll, he'll be our next guy. And then um, as far as big name fighters, we need 55 pounders. We need heavyweights. But, man, I've got enough 85 pounders, yeah. too. And they're all... I mean, they're all phenomenal. Yeah, like Danny Higgins, and yeah. Joey, and Nate Marquardt, and oh my yeah. god, and the list goes on. So well, like, I McDonald, I'm like, wow. Well, I, I was telling Nick. Nick trains down at the at the at the gym with you. I was telling him he would be a great 155. Yeah, should we bring him in? Should I just don't know if he has time? the killer instinct. We have to get him out there and just knock the crap out of him. I yeah, think I and see know. how he does. Yeah, he'll do it. He'd be a great 155. <laughs> yeah, absolutely. And right now, I'm a heavyweight, but I don't think I'm the kind of heavyweight. Come on, you can do it. We can do it. We can get you in there, no problem. I think I'm just a porky heavyweight. No, 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 not at all. Um, so yeah, it, it, it. I don't want a lot more. I am getting to the point for the pros. I mean, and I mean the top level pros, where I think I'm gonna have to say, whoa, that's that's enough now. I, I I'm just gonna get spread too thin. Right. Um, now that doesn't mean up and comers, because up and comers I can do all day. Sure. I've got plan, and we've got some good ones too. So uh, up and comers I can still go, but as far as like the top level UFC fighters, listen, if we get more people in the divisions, we're just gonna end up fighting each other all the time. Yeah. And right. I, I don't want that at all. When Diego and GSP get that business out of the way, hey, that's great. Um, we are now we've got uh, Jason and Nate in the 185ers, and they're yeah. both cleaning house. So it, uh, I just don't want it. Two is plenty. I don't want to end up in the situation where they have to fight each other. Sure. I coaching against my own is like, yeah, it's like punching your brother in the face. I mean, what are you gonna do? So, right. Yeah. Not cool. All not right. Cool. Who All are, um, Go ahead. Who are some of the uh, the up and comers you guys have coming out of there right now? Uh, keep an eye out for uh, Brant Gibbs. Uh, uh, <laughs> he the kid is ten and zero. He's undefeated. He's um, tough as nails, man. And tough boy, he can take a beating and he'll just keep coming. <laughs> he's been in some wars. Uh, he he's really good. Look for Demacio Page. That kid is just phenomenal. He's. Uh, He's one of those guys that we just, he just went to Japan and fought the top kickboxers in the world in the K1 and was holding his own with the, he has never had a kickboxing fight in his life. So I'm like, oh, kickboxing, who cares? Let's go have fun. Well, he drops the guy that, that wins the tournament. He puts him on his butt, the only guy to drop him. So he's, he's that kind of kid. He's got that much potential. Was it his overhand right? His overhand right. Uh, he's got he's a hell of an overhand right, man. Yeah. He does. He's, that thing's a bomb. Yeah, well, he's kicking hard now. He's actually putting, we're putting together this kind of complimentary left hook kind of a deal for it. So yeah, he's really, Improving and the sky's the limit. He's so young and and he's done so well in MMA for not having that much experience and kickboxing too. So, yeah. it uh, yeah. I mean, there's just two names right off the top of my head. There's a bunch of people doing grappling tournaments that we'll be fighting in the future too. So. Yeah, yeah. All right. Well, listen, guys, we're gonna take a break real, real quick and we're gonna come back and we're gonna talk more with Greg Jackson on uh, Cage Talks. So stick around. Thanks for uh, hanging out with us.